Brunel, quick setup. Slant pattern, Jimmy Smith, he's got opening room to the 40. Down to the 25, and somersaulted at the 23-yard line. Patrick Sertain, a 41-yard game. These two teams met in the regular season last year on Monday Night Football, and the game started off with a 77-yard run by Fred Taylor. And Jimmy Johnson worried about the big play. Look at the release by Jimmy Smith as he then clears the rest of the Dolphins' secondary. Brunel with time again, drills it deep, caught, touchdown, Jimmy Smith. Receivers on first down, and he will throw. Mild play action, goes left, intercepted by Aaron Beasley. Picked off by Beasley. And the problems persist for Dan Marino. How about that? This one from just outside the 35, so a 45-yard effort is good. To him, but he knows he doesn't have a big play team, and Jacksonville does. Draw play, Taylor skips two tackles, right, and here we go. Yeah. Bye-bye, Brock Marion chasing. Brock Marion still chasing. Gets help from Smith, touchdown, no flags. A 90-yard run. Could have sworn we were just talking about big plays. One team has them and one team doesn't. 171-yard difference. Marino hit from the back side. Football fumbled the ball. Oh, Lord, Jacksonville has it. And this ball is live. This is still live. Tony Bracken. They haven't blown a whistle yet. No. Nope. And finally, he rumbles toward the end zone. That's a touch touchdown. Touchdown. Oh, jeez. Sacked Marino, fumbled, caused the fumble, picked it up, and ran it in. Screen pass. Look at this. Nobody within 15 yards. Another missed tackle. Another missed tackle. It's become a mantra. That is a touchdown. What, what a tremendous play by Fred Taylor. What an embarrassment for the Miami Dolphins. Equal measures of both. This is as shoddy a tackling effort as I have seen in more than a decade. Well, Patrick Sertain, the first to miss, then Sam Madison gets his effort at it. Sertain misses again. T Central at the same time. Whoa, Hockey bubbles it, it's blocked. Oh, and recovered at the 21-yard line. Corey Chamblin, number 23, as Hutton bobbled the snap, came through to block it. It was a low snap, kind of wobbly. Look at it die. Doesn't have a lot on it, but it was in the air. But it was, you know, you see a first baseman sometime mishandle that soft little lob from the pitcher, and that was the case there. At me, in his fourth year from Dartmouth. Here's the handoff to James Stewart. Got room. He's going to stroll in and score. Flag in the end zone. I am thunderstruck. They might flag Miami for playing so horribly on defense. Jerry Wilson apparently is going to be called for the personal foul. Here's Hockley. Yep. Yeah, that's really a smart play by Jerry Wilson. Putting James Stewart to the ground in the back of the end zone. Yeah, that's, that's showing him. Five yards into the end zone, Jerry Wilson just gives James Stewart. Unnecessary roughness, defense, number 24. It's it's just compounding that much more. The anguish and the pain. Hollis increases the lead. He's two of three for the day. 147 to go before halftime. Four. Uh -oh. And Painter isn't ready for the snap. And the Saints get the first early break. Personnel, now they go to Thomas in the backfield. 
Breeze with a lot of time to the end zone. He goes, and it's a touchdown. Pulled in by Marcus Colston. Breeze very well aware of that. Sets up a screen to the left side. Thomas. And Thomas gets by the thing. He whiffs. And then he chases him down from behind. Second and goal. Breeze to the end zone, and that is caught for a touchdown. Second and goal. As Breeze again has time and throws, and that's caught by Sproles for a touchdown. A little juke move at the goal line, and in he goes. And, and they give it to the up back. That's Jed Collins, a much a traveled free agent pickup, and now they're going to say that he gets in. It's their first third down. On third and seven, and they convert. That's back to school night. He has four kids in Charlotte. The cell phone rings. We need you. One. And breeze wide open is Colston over the middle. And Colston has already been into the end zone. A 47 yard attempt for Casey. And the oldest player in the league. Make it to Austin this time. Set up the screen to Mason the other way. Room to run Mason down the sideline. Inside the five. And he's in. Touchdown, Trey Mason. Running back. Hill keeps it himself. Does he have the speed to get there? He does. Touchdown, Sean Hill. They hand it off. And it's Austin at the 10. Austin cuts back. Touchdown. The Rams are rolling. It's 20 to nothing. Justin Tuck right here in the end. He's not even blocked. And the play goes right up, right past him. He, Tavon Austin is so quick getting that ball and getting past that defensive end that they, they, they have that much confidence. They give it to Mason here. He's got a lot of room. Trey Mason off to the races. Across the 50. One man to beat. Mason to the house. Play action. Hill. And it's caught for a touchdown. Corey Harkey. First touchdown of the season. Carr, pump fake, now throws. Intercepted again. Jermaine Johnson back on his feet at the 20 and ripped down at the 14 by Vincent Brown. The eight yard attempt for Zerlon. 16 out of 20 on the year, and this one is good. First play from about the 12, and there is Vic, as you talked about, John, rolling and watching downfield for Deshaun Jackson, who accelerates, caught the opening play, and all the way for a touchdown. 88 yards. So empty. First and goal, Vic. Dancing, running, in for the touchdown. You'll see him drop back in the pocket. Nothing there to throw the football. But here's what Michael Vick brings to the table. Mobility, escapability, and a nose through the end zone. Look at the vision. He's still looking for the throw. But now once he's in space. Vick shoveling McCoy. 21. Nothing out of the gate, Philadelphia. Very much a part of the decision-making process. Jerome Harrison into the secondary. Harrison cutting back, and he might go. Jerome Harrison. Diving for the pylon. Did he get in? Yes, touchdown. And they're rolling on possession five of the night. Vic taking another shot. This from Macklin. Jeremy Macklin pushed off. Caught it. Touchdown. Oh, man. To give Vic room to run. And score again. Michael Vick, second rushing touchdown of the night from six yards. And that's uh, some of the deep roots tonight. <laughs> Downfield to Jason Avant. From 48 yards. Sneaking it in and good. From Cole Quick, Gafford with the long snap. Chiefs on their opening drive, trying to get on the board on a 33-yarder. And he got it. And the Chiefs lead with... 11 and a half to play. Convert the third down. 40 year old Sav Rocca will punt this off to Dexter McCluster. On the move he goes from about the 30 and breaks free. He's got a block from Hemingway and down the sideline he goes. Breaking a rocket tackle and finally brought down from behind by the Redskins' Trenton Robinson. The speed merchant McCluster 
racing downfield, 48, and the Chiefs with great beginning position. It all starts, Sav Rock is one of the, the lowest ranked punters in the NFL. This is a line driver to one of the more talented return men in football, Dexter McCluster. He hits this one going downhill. You see the block right there on Araka, and then McCluster gets the rest done. It's Charles, and he is in for the touchdown. A late call, but in he goes, and Jamal Charles has now just run over his 10th goal line of the season. 10th rushing touchdown. And KC. Roy Hallou is an intercept, and it's picked off. There goes Derek Jensen in the snow, in the slush, and the other way. Smith, Charles, oh, and a sweep block inside by Fisher. That is a five-yard touchdown catch and run. And they are big, heavy flakes. Rocka. And he sends McCluster all the way back to about the 26-yard line. Looking for a block. Here he goes again. Cooper throws a beauty. And there he goes. McCluster by Rocka. He's chased by Paulson. And into the end zone. That is a Kansas City touchdown. Armed, oh, you do with your legs. Here comes Demps on the kickoff. He finds a seam, Forbeth can't get him. Now he's chased by Wilson. A block ahead, it's thrown by Davis. A great cut inside, that is a touchdown! 95 yards! Wow. And the second special teams touchdown today <laughs> as they are living right in Washington this afternoon. This is incredible. Steve Taub, the special teams coach for the Kansas City Chiefs, he's just smiling. He said, I don't, I don't know what we're doing right. Maybe they're doing everything right. Look, they set the wall, and look at Dips. Look, that's just a poor effort by the kicker for the Redskins. They don't slow him down. Then look here. Turns him back into the other guys, and you've got to get him out of bounds there. You've got to be able to get him out of bounds. He's one step away. E.J. Biggers, number 30. Look right here. Now, he don't even pull his flag, and he doesn't even step out.